Hello everybody, my name is Craig Bennett and today we're taking a look at a product within Eco Global Survive and it's the brick and also we're looking at the brick roof. Now as far as the brick and brick roof, you can learn these skills through the masonry skill and it's under the stoneworking skill. It takes up to level 3 to learn brick and level 4 to learn brick roof. Now, as far as the things I would note is I would uh, highly suggest getting a stone proficiency up there. Um, you don't have to get as far as I did, but I would highly suggest get it up there because it takes three bricks to make one brick or one brick roof. They both cost the same. And um, as far as the overall cost, you can actually knock that down to two stones and take a look at... Uh, this right here I'm at a level four and it's down two stones almost down to one stone if I keep going a little bit further probably about two more levels and um, that's per actual brick now notes the efficacy the, the, the more effective that you have your level at the larger the work order the less stones you need to have even though it says two I can actually get almost down to looking like it's one. Now, as far as brick, the brick roof is the brick right here that has the teeth. As you see here, if we take away that, um, the brick, normal brick does not have teeth. And if we actually just put this on the ground just to show, you can actually see that it goes on both sides. And I'll show you on the roof what that looks like when you have something on the inside. Now, as far as the overall brick, as you see here, it, you can actually make it look somewhat good. But note that you can actually see where each and every floor is because it's bulged out a bit. Now, the problem is, is when you got stairways or other things. So if we look on the other side, you can actually see that it looks pretty bad on this side simply because this is where the massive stairway is and you can actually see where the floor ends right here and where the floor ends like right there this is something i wish that was easily fixable um, obviously you can put your stairs a little bit more on the inside but i don't think that this is a, a good compromise for putting it on the outside problem that i found with this is say if you're working on that top floor what I can do is, if it was open, I could just jump up all these steps. And then I, if it was open, I can just go in here and steal whatever. Now, as far as the overall brick on the inside, this is actually what it looks like. So you can see the gaps in the walls right there. That's actually what it looks like. And you can see the gap, the gap right there. So note that whenever you're putting your brick up. So as far as what it looks like um, on a roof side, if you have, th say, dirt or something, like I do, like a rooftop garden or a rooftop park, whatever you want to call it, you can see right here where uh, we have a stairwell, the teeth are going on both sides for the brick roof. This is a problem that you need to keep in mind when building your stuff something i wish i knew about when i first built this um, it's easily fixable by making things a little bit higher but as far as um that that goes i have to walk around it um, but notes that we have the teeth on this side but teeth are not on that side because we have dirt now it notes that you need that brick in order to for the blast furnace, the cement, or a few other things. So you need to have a chimney, and um, and obviously you need to have brick under it connecting to it. I want to note that you can actually use it as a floor. So let's knock that out, those two out, and you can actually see that this is the pattern that you will get if. Um, if you use it as a floor it's going to look like this but obviously much bigger if, if your floor looks much bigger so just note that and note that's how it works now as far as things goes um, overall i think it is worthwhile to build 
yeah, it's, uh, as far as looks goes, it is worthwhile to look. But note that some tools like a blast furnace and a few other things requires brick. Also, one thing to note, uh, this mortar stone, brick can replace that. It's, it's a higher tier mortar stone to note that that uh, you can actually have a um, anything that says that it needs mortar stone. If it's if the room's made out of brick or majority of it's made out of brick, the brick will be counted for any mortar stone. So note that in the mortar stone, just for anyone who's curious, it acts exactly the same as brick. It just looks differently. So as far as that goes, um, hopefully that you enjoyed this and hopefully this has helped you out. If it has, then leave a like, subscribe, share. And please feel free to let me know what you want me to cover in a future video. And please feel free to check out my main channel. But anyways, hope you have a great day.